Ladies and gentlemen, my friend, your friend, and a good friend of Charleston, Leon Stavronakis. Thank you all for being here. Um, Ann and I are so grateful for all of your support and hard work and passion. Um, when we started this journey, uh, the decision to run and the race we ran was all about the place we love, Charleston. And as I stand here today, nothing about that has changed. It's still all about this place that I love. A few minutes ago, I called John Tecklenburg and con congratulated him on being elected the next mayor of Charleston. And I uh, told him that whatever capacity I continue to serve our community in, I am at his service to the benefit of our city and the people of our city. Um, I know everyone in this room worked really, really hard. Uh, for this campaign and, and for our vision for Charleston. And thousands of Charlestonians out there backed us and voted for us. And I'm asking all of you and everyone at home that can hear me to do the same. Our city is losing one of the great leaders in the history of America. And our new mayor will need every single one of us pulling in the same direction to continue to make Charleston the very best place in America to live, work, and raise a family. So I need all of you to join me in saying that tomorrow morning, the race is over. And that it's all about Charleston, the work to do to deal with traffic, to deal with our schools, to deal with our future. And so I need all of you to help me work with our new mayor again to make Charleston the very, very best place that it can be moving forward. Definitely, a little while ago, Mayor Riley was here, and Joe Riley III's been with me all day and really with me for 10 months. Joe, thank you. You've been great. And as the year comes to an end, I think it, it's worth repeating over and over again what an amazing, amazing blessing we have had to have Mayor Riley lead this city and this region for the last 40 years. We really have been blessed to have his incredible vision, his courage. He's never afraid to take on the tough, tough tasks of moving our city forward. It's not always easy. I've worked with him uh, a lot, and he has driven me hard <laughs> when, when he's needed to. 